Another important um, basic element is the contact form. So on your website, you probably want to have a contact form so people can reach out to you um, if they have any questions or if, they're, or if they want to just want to interact with you. Weebly allows you to do this very quickly. Drag down a contact form here and it gives you all the basics of what a person will fill out um, when they insert the information on the contact form. But you can actually customize this very easily. Click into the contact form and you can start um, you know, changing the name of the field. For example, if I can go uh, instead of your name, I'm just going to go your name. And you can set this as required or not required. So typically, at the minimum, inserting your name will be a required field. And you can click on advance and have control the margin there. Email as well, you can change from email to go insert your email. Just for an example, as you can see, the, um, the, the description here changes right away. So when you're done with customizing the contact form, you can actually control the form option here. And so you can insert your email address here. Um, by default, it's going to be the email address that you signed up for an account with Weebly. But you can insert whatever other email address you want. And when you're done, click Save. And the form will be ready after you publish the website. The next element um, that's very helpful is the custom HTML element. When you drag it down, you basically have the capability to insert HTML codes. Now, if you want to insert a lot of uh, non-Weebly widgets, uh, there are tons of widgets out there that can help improve your site, such as Facebook like buttons or, or Twitter feed. Uh, those developers usually give you some HTML codes. This element here allows you to drag and drop an element here and basically feed in those HTML codes and it will appear uh, on your website. So it makes it very easy to bolt on external widgets. The site search box here is a very helpful tool as well. You can drag and drop into any part of your website. And um, the, the use of the search box is so that your, your visitors can search for very specific things that they're looking for. This search box is only available under the Pro users, so you have to subscribe to Weebly Pro before you can activate this feature. So those are the major basic elements that Weebly provide you, and it really is, a, is not a whole lot of bells and whistles, as I said in my comprehensive review, but these are the ones that will actually be used 95% of the time when you're building your website. So it's very simple very easy to use and you can drag and drop these things as you wish. Um, if you want to move the paragraph down here you can do so like that and you can switch the uh, picture element over here like so. And it's super flexible, you can play around with it, it's super intuitive to use, uh, user interface is very friendly, everybody can use this and master it within just a very short period of time.